I played football one day and I was like, this is the stupidest shit ever. <laughs> Running to somebody for two hours straight. I used to joke with uh, a coach at my high school. I played one day and I can't, and he put me on, he, we used to joke, he put me on the defensive line. But the only, the only time you really work in football is if you're on the offensive line or defensive line. You sit somebody every play. And I went out there for two hours, just ran to this other dude for two hours straight. And I get back in the locker room, I'm totally exhausted. And I got my head down. My every part of my body is hurting. And the coach says to me, I'll see you tomorrow. I said, I'm not doing this shit tomorrow. <laughs> I, and, and I said, Coach, no disrespect. I walked up to him afterwards. I said, Coach, this ain't for me. So my football expertise, my experiment lasted one day. So it definitely wouldn't be anybody in football. Baseball, I don't want to stand out in the hot sun every day, six, seven days a week. Um, it would probably be golf. Uh, you know, I love playing golf. It's fun. I love being out there walking around those big old trees. There's nobody around bugging you. So, you know, Ernie Els is a, is a guy I know vaguely who I admire and respect. Tiger is the greatest golfer ever. So it'd probably be somebody in golf. I mean, you can pick, you can work 30 weeks a year. If you're really great at it, you can do it. Because really, it's the only thing you can do now. You can't play any other sport once you, I mean, I the last two times I touched a basketball, I blew out my knee. <laughs> I learned a lesson. Old people should not try to play basketball. Uh, so it would probably be, it would probably be for real uh, golf. You know I got this. Hey, you know, it's so funny. One thing on my bucket list, I got a chance last summer to play golf with Gary Player. And he had heard through the grapevine that I was like, I want to want to play them. So he was in Philadelphia and he the guy called me and said, Hey, Gary Player is here. He want to talk to you. I says, Hey, Mr. Player, how you doing? He says, Charles Barkley, here you want to meet me and play golf with me? I said, Yes, sir, it'd be an honor and a privilege. He said, well, you want to play tomorrow? I said, hell yeah, I want to play tomorrow. I called my secretary. I said, if I got anything on the schedule tomorrow, you cancel it right away.